<clears throat> okay, yeah, I'm back. All right. So, uh, yeah, I think that was a computer issue, so I just restarted the thing, and yeah, we'll get back to it. No big deal. A little bit of an issue. I had to hang up on uh, my teacher. That was pretty rude. Hello? Hi, Elaine. It's me again. Rose Angela, what can I help you with? What can you tell me about Jamie? I hate to speak ill of her, but she was a disappointment. How so? At first, she was very keen about her work. She was a brilliant writer, but that brilliance soon faded. By midterm, she'd show up for class late and hung over, and when she showed up at all. And as for what she was wearing, well, let's just say it wasn't appropriate. Girl. What made her brilliant? She had a way of infecting you with her passion. When she loved something, she could make you love it too. She had a keen interest in Middle Eastern history. So it was no surprise that most of her work had Middle Eastern themes to them. But as I said, that faded with time. She stopped having a passion for much of anything, I think. Such a waste. What was wrong with her clothes? I'm no prude, but what she was wearing should stay in Munray's where it belongs. Munray's? Munray's? It's a nightclub. It's a popular hangout for the students here. And Jamie went there? She wore their t-shirts, so I'd assume yes. Although it was more like a half a shirt. <laughs> what made her brilliant? Well, like I said, she had a way of infecting you with her passion. When she loved something, she could make you love it too. She had a keen interest in Middle Eastern history. So it was no surprise that most of her work had Middle Eastern themes to them. But as I said, that faded with time. She stopped having a passion for much of anything, I think. Such a waste. What made her brilliant? Well, like I said, she had a, but as I said, such a way. Hmm. You said she faded. What do you think happened to her? I don't know. I wish I did. At the time, I figured it was the typical story. Young, sheltered girl comes to the city and gets overwhelmed with the freedom of it all. Most adjust fine. Some, well, don't. I could tell she was troubled, but I learned long ago that it isn't my place to reach out. I remember you being a bit closed off once upon a time. Yes, well, we all change. How did Jamie die? I'm not sure. No foul play, if that's what you're asking. It was a clot in the brain or something like that. Yeah. Really? That's what the police said anyway. Brain hemorrhage. This again. Why were the police involved? If she died by natural causes, why involve them? I wondered the same thing myself. The detective, a man named Durkin, I believe, wasn't very forthcoming. Why were the police in- I want the Durkin. That's who I'm talking to right now. Have you ever heard of STP? I'm afraid not. Do you know a guy named Jeremy Sams? Hmm. No. Do you ever go up to the High Line? It's gorgeous, isn't it? My husband and I went for a walk there last summer. But you haven't been back since? No, we haven't. Why? Oh, no reason. Have you ever heard of a man named Gavin? Gavin? Can't say I know any Gavins. Is there anything else you could tell me about Jamie? If there's anything specific you'd like to know, just ask. Does the name Tiffany Walters mean anything to you? Hmm, no, I don't know anyone with that name. Do you know anyone named Rachel? I'm afraid not. You don't know any Rachels? That's impossible. So what is Munray's like? I wouldn't know. My clubbing days are long gone. I just embarrass myself. I should get go- Sure. Hmm, okay. Seems like you can circle back on a lot. Time in magazine. 
Oh, Time In Magazine. Okay, Jesus. Tomo? This shit again. Is there a radio or something in here? God, that song is horrible. It's horrible. A $20 cover for this dump? You got robbed. What? I said you got robbed. I look like a slob? No. <laughs> well, yes, kind of. Ah, just forget it. Hi. Hello. They're ignoring me. There's a sign that says the VIP area is closed. I could try and climb over, but I'd get caught instantly. Search for a song, huh? He's just looking at me funny. I guess he doesn't want to talk to me. He looks drunk, whoever he is. Hey, guy. Hi. So, I can't just chat with some stranger. Not here, anyway. It's a nightclub. I'm pretty sure that's what it's for. He's just leaning against the wall. Hi. Hi, got a sec? Hello? She's serving a bunch of customers on the other side. I can't get her attention. The last time I drank on the job, it didn't end too well. Just Although, do believe it. me, I'm tempted. Yes, just do it. I can't read the labels, but it looks... These are placed all over the club. Um... I love the idea. I just can't come... There's a reason I can't. Never gets old. <laughs> no reaction. This guy's far gone. Not sure what blowing. Not sure what. I'm not gonna waste my. Excuse me, could I ask? Hello? Ow, hey, watch the arm. Um, yeah, that's not gonna work. How did she get out of there ungroped? Ahem. Hello? She's still not probably just as well. Jamie Graham, aren't you? Do I know you? Not yet, but uh, I hope to change that. You think so, huh? Mm -hmm. Anyway, I'm Joey. Uh huh. Yeah, you are definitely underage. Care to dance? Whatever. No, this music sucks. You come here often? Don't think I've seen you before. Maybe you have, but I know I've never seen you. Hey? I wouldn't forget a Rat Pack reject like you. What's up with that, anyway? Reject? I'll have you know this fabric is top of the line. Look at me, I'm impressed. Are you even old enough to be in here? Sure I am. I've got the best ID money can buy. So 
So, what brings you here? It's a place to go, right? It's a place, I'll give it that. So, how about a drink? No thanks. <laughs> Come on, just one drink and a conversation. If you still don't like me, you can dump it on me. Deal? Don't tempt me. Interesting me. It's alright. I think you said it sucked. Care to Whatever. Okay, I have to change the song. Oh. Okay, I can search up epileptic... What was it? Epileptic... Um... Shit. I don't remember what it was. I'll have to go find out. Are you alone here tonight? That's a crime. Whatever. I'm here with friends. Friends, huh? They'll be here any minute. Well, in the meantime, how about we get to know each other? How about not? Why are you- Please, I've already got a dog back home. Hey, now that's a bit uncalled for. His name is Benji. That's pretty you good like line, him. We've got a lot in common. Hey, you. Why are you- Please, hey. his name- I've got a- I Was it epileptic? Not from out. Not from out. Looks like a poster for. I've heard Fish, of course. Pretty smooth myself. Look at me, I'm swooning. <laughs> hey, she's still dancing. Still got a show. So, tell me about yourself. You got a question? Where are you from? Uh, nowhere special. Where are you from? New York. Born and raised. Somehow I could tell. So, you got a so what? Nothing important. How about you? What did you study back in the dark ages? Okay, I'm trying to talk about you, Jamie. I mean, don't want to make this date all about myself. Entertainment. You know, pictures. I was going to be the next Cecil B. DeMille. Who? Ugh, forget it. Kids today don't know they're born. I should go through all those, but... Do the initials STP mean anything to you? Huh? No. Have you ever been up to the High Line? The what line? Never mind. Do you know anyone named Gavin? Shh. Shut up and dance. Hmm. So, can you tell me where I can find him? Shh. Shut up. Do you know any Rachels? Huh? Tell me about Professor Appleton. Um, no. I don't come here to talk about school. She's right here. So, what's the deal with this place anyway? What do you mean? It's loud. It's got zero class. Why come here? To be free, of course. To be really alive, you need to let yourself go. 
I used to be so scared of places like this. But they're so liberating, don't you think? I could die tomorrow. Life's too short. Well... So, you think you're liberated? Yes. I... I feel so free now. I always felt something was missing. I needed to get out of my stuffy room and live. <laughs> and you do that by coming here? I have fun. I've never had so much fun before. And I'm happy, damn it. So much happier. Why are you being like this? You barely know me. Please, I've already got it. Hey. His name is... You were scared of this place? Places like it. I didn't think it was me. I never would have thought of going to a place like this a year ago. But now, I can't think of anything else. You said you could die tomorrow. Do you ever think about that? Jeez, what's with the doom and gloom? You brought it up, not me. I can't think about that. If and when I go, I want to say I enjoyed my life. And have you? What kind of question is that? Of course I have. Well, there you go. You're good to go. So. You got it. So. Nothing. English. For a guy who studied English, you sure talk funny. I studied English. I talk funny. So. You got. So. Nothing important. History. Really? What kind of history? European. That's pretty broad. Europe is quite diverse. Well, I did my best. I'm sure. Um, did Appleton tell me uh, about her history class? I'm not sure. So, you got. So, nothing much. This Oops. usually isn't my scene. You'd find me at home with a book most nights. Really? I used to read all the time. Not anymore? Nah. So what do you like to read? Blackwell. <laughs> There's this book by a lady named Blackwell. Ever hear of her? No. Is she any good? The best. Depends who you ask. I'll pass then. So, tell me. You got Where are you from? <sighs> Where did she say she was from? The Midwest. Really? Whereabouts? Wisconsin. Wisconsin. Oh, never been. Okay. Where did she say she was from? Damn it. I suck. So. You got a question? Where are you? Uh, the Midwest. Really? Where? Wyoming. Oh, never been there. So, you got it. Uh, I'm dead. Really? Wouldn't have guessed that. I'm in it. Right. Hmm. Okay, so Midwest is correct. So, you got it. Uh, the really? Where? Michigan. Oh. So, you got it. Where? Uh, the really? Where? No way. So am Ooh. I. Where in Illinois? Jesus. Chicago? Chicago? Oh, from city to city, huh? Somehow I could tell. Okay, I gotta get much more specific information. So you got nothing. History. Really? Pre is flat like Dino. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. so, so nothing. The, really? Not even. Nah. Anything. Huh. So I gotta find maybe who bought her books? I know what you like to read. What time is it? <coughs> Alright, it's 11 a.m. I'm gonna see how far I can take this conversation with Jamie, and then I think I'm gonna quit for the day. It's been a long day streaming so far. Got a lot of day ahead of me as well. Woban, thanks again for joining me. I saw Velasque, I saw Totally was watching me as well. Thanks, everybody. Always good to see familiar faces. So, you got it. So, nothing. Mr. Really? So, you know, I used to be the same way. Everyone has their own opinion about what goes on there, but it's so ancient. 
But you can never truly understand anything unless you know where it came from. I know what you mean. Things move so fast nowadays. I know, right? Nobody else gets it. And you do? I thought I did, once. Maybe we can talk more about it sometime? I'd like that. Why are you- Please. Hey, now that- His name is- So- You got- Alright. Uh, okay. So I gotta finish all three of those. I've got a- <sighs> Alright. Everybody, have a great day. Well, when you have a great night. Um, we'll see you down the road. I'll probably be streaming this again tomorrow. Not sure if I'll be streaming anything else later today. Uh, hopefully I'll get, be able to get some Dragon Age at some point. Um, but tomorrow, hope to finish this game. Uh, we should be able to. Might even be able to start the next one. Um, we'll see. Anyway, have a good rest of your day. Goodbye.